everybody. So this is activity four of our um, sensory sibling series. And what I've got here is I just have a big bo um, box of warm water, which what I've done is I've put a lot of bubble bath in it and whisked it up using a whisk. What you can see is that there's quite a little water and a lot of bubbles. And the reason for that is when I drop these balls in here, they're going to be harder to see for my learners. So you can't see them. What I'm aiming here is that my students are going to scoop bubbles out with spoons, they can fish them with jugs, or they can get them out with their hands if they ask for the balls. So whatever my learners do is what we're going to interact with. Okay, so we've got this big tub of water, guys, and all of these things. I want ball, let's see if you can find one. Let's have a look. <gasps> a yellow ball, wow. Jug, there you go. What are you gonna do with that? <gasps> Splash! <gasps> oh no, it's all wet. I want the big spoon. The, the big spoon. Wow. A spoon. You want a spoon too. There you go. I want a jug, a jug for you! Ooh, look how many balls you've got! Splash! A ball! Let's find you a ball, Matt. Here you go. Oh, yay! You got one on your spoon. Splash! Should we try again, see if you can do it on your own? Oh, Wow. 